genuinely want to know what like what do older men and this car this is the freaking fourth time this car has passed by oh my gosh next time i'm gonna freaking flip it off i genuinely want to know what men get from stopping their car literally he's hauling a freaking huge trailer huge trailer from stopping their car to slow down to like dude you're freaking 60 like what are you doing like freaking your parts don't even work anymore what are you doing what are you doing like what like i don't i genuinely don't understand and this isn't the first time it happens i'm just like so sick of it because like i said this is like the freaking 10th time that this car passes by so slow mysteriously do you think i'm dumb like do you really think i'm dumb like damn get a grip get a grip go freaking man i'm just so mad like I stopped to stretch. I'm here at freaking the park. You guys know what park I'm talking about. I'm here at the wreck. And it's like, when I really think about it, I've been running since I was freaking five. Like, and this still hasn't stopped. This still hasn't stopped since I was five. I'm 21 now. Put that into perspective. And these guys are still doing that. Like, I'm telling you, we're, we got to take action as women because it's ridiculous. The fact that it's happened so often. And these guys still act so oblivious to it. Like, like I'm going to say hi to you. And then what do you think the next step is going to be? We're going to go out on a date? What do you think? Like, what, what genuinely do you think? Are you dumb? Like, you must be that dumb. That really, really that dumb. For me to be like, oh my gosh, let me stop and say hi to her. Because then she's going to call me. No, no. Get a grip on life. Freaking go find somebody your own age. My rant. Because in all honesty, like, I'm just really mad. Because... These guys are passing by multiple times, and it's like, for what at this point? Like, I'm not dumb, stupid, or slow. Do not try to, like, treat me like, oh my gosh, you know, you forgot something at your house six times, six times, six times. Like, like, stop, stop. Don't ever put me in an uncomfortable position. Don't ever put women in an uncomfortable position. And if you're a guy, freaking, you better take action. And you better freaking help us out. Like, I'm so sick and tired of this. I freaking dedicated a whole entire post to this. Like, I'm telling you, this has happened since I was five. Like, it has not stopped. It's ridiculous. And at this point, freaking, we got to carry a gun because these guys don't get the point. And I'm, like, really, really sorry for anyone else that has ever had to, like, go through this. Like, if you're a woman, I'm so, so sorry because I 100% understand the situation that you're put in. And it's so uncomfortable. And honestly, like, you can't even run, which I've, like, I've been doing, like, freaking since I was small. Like, this is, this is not just a sport to me. It's something that, like, it's, like, my livelihood. It's something I've done so many times. So it's, like, you know, this is what I grew up doing. And it's, just like, damn, I can't even do what I freaking grew up doing. And I can't even freaking enjoy it because these men have to come out here and try to ruin things. Like, I'm genuinely just so, so mad. And I just need to go home because, like, it's just, it's tough not feeling safe. It's just genuinely so For those of you guys laughing at my story, because some of my comments, I get it. Like, okay, I get it. I'm funny. I get it. It was funny. But I really want you guys to see the bigger picture as to why I'm frustrated and as to why many women are fed up because it's not okay so I get it ha 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 but just please understand like why I'm saying what I'm saying and why I'm at that was like the fastest I've ever ran home I'm home um you don't have anything like good to say keep your comments to yourself you do yourself a favor and just shut up um i'm really really fed up another incident happened i just don't want to talk about it i already told one of my friends um it's just tough it's tough all around and yeah like i said if you just don't have anything nice to say or like anything like you know that genuinely correlates with what i stand for which is ke keeping women like safe and stopping the predatory vibes and just shut up and unfollow me because i'm really really pissed right now because of the second incident um but yeah i'm home so i guess